and stuff. So I, it was cool to see him like uh, bring together like an almost thirty-person tournament and within like a week. You know? Oh yeah, I was I was definitely impressed with the turnout. Yeah, me too. Man, very surprised. Especially for a tournament that didn't get advertised in the Facebook group. It was just like Twitter and Discord. Didn't he, yeah. he posted it one time on Facebook, right? No, that was dark. That was me. I did it like oh, yesterday. Yeah. I see. Yeah. Because I was like, wait, I haven't seen anything here. He was like, I don't have Facebook. I'm like, oh. <laughs> yeah, he deactivated, I think. Yeah. This that would explain why I couldn't find him when I was trying to message him. Kind of unfortunate for Yid because I feel like, you know, Frey's a Ness main and then Yoshi is pretty much Ness. <laughs> Yoshi is pretty much Ness. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, that's enough. <laughs> that and Frey's, Frey... like, Frey's good with Yoshi. Yeah, yeah, he has a really yeah. Good Yoshi, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, that was a good mash out. Is there a character oh. Frey isn't good with? Uh, Link. Link. <laughs> yeah, Link. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he's fine, but I haven't seen him play like Jigglypuff. Yeah, Link on delay doesn't sound like fun, so it's probably one of the characters. Yeah, it just makes that jump squat ten times worse. Also, if you're used to using fast characters and then you play Link, it's just like, ugh. Yeah. Yeah. You have fast characters plus delay? That's rough. I uh, I competed in a eight frame uh, tournament because I was playing. Uh, oh, the Europe tournament? tournament? Yeah, the EU tournament. Oh yeah. man, everything's a read. You can't you can't react at all. You just have to read every interaction. That's it. That sounds like my nightmare. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I feel like fucking two frames is enough delay for me to feel like shit. Yeah. And then plus whatever weird stuff you get from like a monitor and yeah exactly and your your operating system or whatever the hell and also emulator just runs like way faster I feel definitely yeah, more consistent like ten frame, ten frame or so. it's like weird because you have like delay but then it also runs faster and then like certain interactions are just not they don't happen on console. Dude, dogs, you uh, you should have tried playing Metal Mario with that delay. <laughs> <laughs> um, Samsung won the EU tournament. He's uh, he's an online only EU player. And oh, cool. He's, uh, he's like basically tied for best player. Like him and Jam are decisively the best nice. EU players. Did uh, did Jam play in this most recent one? He did not. He didn't like how long the tournament lasted last time. Like, pools lasted like three and a half hours or something. Oh, and geez. then, uh, so he's like, an hour. like I'm, I don't want to mess with that. And pools lasted like an hour or so. Like, it was really fast this time. He's like, what the hell, guys? Like, why is it fast? Am I done? Anyway. They they just, you know, they, they got more setups this time. <laughs> Honestly, online tournaments used to run so long. Why? I think people were just like not ready, like ever. It used to be so annoying. They're pretty nice now. Yeah, they're they're good now. I mean, like the two that I've entered. <laughs> yeah, they they've all been running pretty smoothly since like since you know last April when we started running the bigger ones. I was very impressed with how well quarantine ran for how big it was. Yeah. Like, we had some issues with, like, lag and stuff once we got to the West Coast tournament. Oh, I remember, yeah, I forgot about that. Yo, Beagle, what's up? And, Ooh, and honestly, the West Coast tournament... Did jump there, too? It's, it might have run okay if we weren't trying to... If we would, had just been doing K-Rex only. All right. But that was, like, our first big online tournament, and we were trying to do, like, live matches. Yeah. And then we realized the folly of our ways. Yeah, that's uh that tech roll in there is like a really like common thing, <laughs> but you just fall over that with the back air. Yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, this looks really hard for the Yid. Yeah, I mean, does Yid really play characters besides, like, Yoshi and maybe a few of the top tiers? No, he does. His, his cast is pretty solid. He plays, he yeah, he plays, like, oh, nice. he plays Fox, he plays Falcon every now and then. He plays the top three pretty competently. Like he's, he's very yeah, that's why I he's said the top. top. I, I knew he played. The I've top. never seen him play Kirby, so I don't know about that. But I've seen him play Falcon, Fox, Pika. You're uh, you're facing the wrong way there, Frey. <laughs> <They're smoothing. laughs> His Kirby's solid. All right, yeah, this is your chance. Kirby, but it's good. At least Yid tries to get back. Ooh. Uh -huh. It's got it's got to be rough going from like playing you know, so oh, much no. Yoshi to to switching to a DJ, DJC character that doesn't have armor. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> No, this is like closest thing to armor is his like big ass oh. head. On up His head, his head is uh, invincible, not intangible, right? When he does right. Um, it is. No, blue is blue is intangible. No, green's intangible, right? Oh wait. No, green's invincible because that's what Samus okay. and DK's hands have. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Is, so is his head green or blue? I think it's blue. It's green? Okay, so yeah, invincible. So you can still grab it if you like get it before it comes out in front of him or whatever. I think I think Fair might have actually caught him there, but Frey didn't go for it. Well, he went for it, but then he like came back. Yeah, you'd think that, uh, Poger, but you play against Frey, he makes it very tricky. But yeah, in general, it's true. The pants. Yeah, Ness's head is blue. Oh, so it's intangible. It's intangible. Yeah, wow. there are really only a few things that are invincible. Just though, I can't think of another one besides Samus and DK. Yeah, for DK, it's just his hands. His whole body is intangible during the up B, but his hands are invincible during the aerial one only. It's just weird, weird stuff. Wow, that was actually pretty close. You kept that competitive for sure. At least for that game. Yeah. <laughs>